Hey, how's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here and in today's GTA 5 video we're going to be looking at all the new content added today in the brand new update to Grand Theft Auto Online including some free money that Rockstar is going to be handing out and a whole lot more. So that's right, it's Thursday, which means it's time for another new event week in Grand Theft Auto Online, and Rockstar have done some interesting things this week. Let's just say that. So every time Thursday rolls around, the first thing I do is immediately open up my phone to see what new vehicle Rockstar has added. So I ended up checking the Legendary Motorsports site first, and I noticed, okay, no new vehicle here. The last one is the Benefactor Krieger, so maybe Rockstar released a vehicle this time that wasn't on the Legendary Motorsports site. No big deal. I'll just head over to the Southern San Andreas Super Auto site, and when I got over to that site, I noticed that it was the Zion Classic. Wait a minute. The Zion Classic was released last week, so no new vehicle on Legendary Motorsports, no new vehicle on Southern San Andreas. Is this a mistake on Rockstar's end? So I ended up checking out the other websites too, just to make sure there wasn't any error. I checked Benny's, of course, no new vehicles there. The Arena War site, no new vehicles there. And then the Newswire post came out, and I realized that Rockstar didn't release a new vehicle this week, for whatever odd reason. So I'm not sure why they decided to do that. This would be the first time since the Diamond Casino and Resort update came out that Rockstar have not released a new vehicle. So I can't explain why that's the case. Maybe it's because Rockstar want us to focus on the other bits of content that have come out this week, which we'll get into in a little bit. But long story short, there is no new vehicle that has been introduced. Not the Ocelot Jugular, not any of the other cars you were looking forward to. Again, for whatever reason, Rockstar just decided not to do that. However, even though there is no new vehicle this week, there's still a lot of pretty cool things going on, including a new podium car that you can win by spinning the lucky wheel. And this one's a pretty fun one. It's the Declasse Mamba. The Mamba was actually added in the Executives and Other Criminals update, like back at the end of 2015. And then I think last year it actually got a little bit of an update where it received some new liveries. And that's what you can kind of see on the podium, sort of the enhanced version. And whenever there's a new vehicle added to the podium, I always try and win by spinning the lucky wheel. And this time I got really, really close, but unfortunately no cigar, as I ended up getting one short and walking away with 15,000 RP. So one of these days when I'm recording these videos, I'm going to win the lucky wheel car and it's going to be fun, but it hasn't happened yet. Now, the next thing that you should do this week, like all event weeks in Grand Theft Auto Online, is take a stop by the casino store. Rockstar says there's always a rotating selection of exclusive clothing, accessories, and artworks from some of Los Santos' most coveted brands like Broker, Bigness, and artists like Billy Wiener and Zelma Bosch. So again, check out the casino store. There might be some articles of clothing or items in there that you have missed throughout the last couple of weeks. While you're inside of the casino store, stop by the wardrobe department and you can actually unlock the Declasse logo white tee. So this simple t-shirt works nicely with the podium car. If you were to win the Declasse Mamba, it's a white t-shirt with the Declasse text and you get it for free of charge just for playing Grand Theft Auto Online this week. So there you go. That is one of the free t-shirts that Rockstar is handing out. Now, one of the big things that Rockstar introduced this week is a set of brand new survivals and the survival series. Now, we're going to be talking about this more in depth in a video later on because there's a lot to discuss, including payouts, how much money you can make, and more. Uh, but Rockstar says, survival of the fittest. Hunker down and test your mettle in seven new survival challenges. Fend off a Bala's attack on Grove Street. Battle Avon Hertz's armed goons and heavily armed juggernauts in the nuclear bunker, and much more. For quick access, jump into the Survival series featuring all seven new maps plus nine classic locations. So long story short, there's seven new survivals that you can play in addition to the nine classic ones this week, and they are also handing out double money. So double money in RP on those new survival missions. And on top of that, Rockstar also giving out double money in RP on all mobile operation center missions. 
So those are the ones that you can do from the back of your MOC. So overall, it's a pretty great way to make some money. We'll talk about some of the specifics as we go on a little bit later in the day. Now, there's also a ton of discounts that Rockstar have got going on this week, and they made it pretty easy. Everything I'm about to mention is 40% off. The first is a Declasse blowout sale. So they're literally giving 40% off the following Declasse vehicles. The Scramjet, the Drift Tampa, the Hot Ring Saber, the Saber Turbo, the Moonbeam, the Tornado, Tulip, Vamos, Voodoo, and Yosemite. I didn't even know there were that many Declasse vehicles in the game, but all the ones I just listed are 40% off. There's also some Warstock vehicles getting that same discount. The Mobile Operation Center is 40% off, which is awesome because if you don't own it, that means that you can get into those lucrative gun running businesses for a little bit cheaper. And also the Avenger is 40% off as well. So that's quite nice. Now there's some nice vehicle upgrades too. Benny's upgrades, 40% off. Same with hydraulics, engines, engine blocks and air filters, exhaust, doors, seats, steering wheels, liveries, roofs, and trunks, all 40% off. And then sort of randomly, there are some weapon discounts for 40% off too, like shotguns, SMGs, assault rifles, and throwables, likely to prepare you for the survivals that are happening. Now, there's also a bunch of Twitch Prime benefits that are happening as well. Twitch Prime members who linked their Rockstar Social Club accounts before September 22nd can still get a free master penthouse. And Rockstar really upping the ante here as additionally, players who connect their accounts can purchase the Fort Zancudo Hangar 3499 and the Lago Zancudo Bunker for a rebate on the base property after purchase. So basically, you can get a free hangar and a free bunker in addition to the free master penthouse. That's basically three free properties there if you don't own them. You also get an additional 10% off of all the discounts we just talked about. So instead of them being 40% off, they'll all be 50% off. And then 60% off of the Overflawed Ott's Arch Hypercar, as well as 80% off of the Arena variants of the Declasse Brutus and Impaler vehicles. So this week's Twitch Prime stuff is actually really, really good. So something you should totally take advantage of. Now, one of the coolest things that Rockstar has got going on this week is they're actually giving away $1 million for free. They said to celebrate another year of Grand Theft Auto Online, play anytime from today through next week and get a cool $1 million for free. Now look for the funds to be deposited into your Maze Bank account by October 9th. So how about that? All you have to do is play Grand Theft Auto Online starting today through October 2nd, which is basically next Wednesday, and you will get $1 million that will be added to your account by the following Thursday on October 9th. So that $1 million can go a long way to purchasing one of the new vehicles or a new property, or you can just save it up for whatever Rockstar has planned next. So I guess this is their official way of basically celebrating the anniversary of Grand Theft Auto Online by handing out some free money. That is pretty awesome. And I should mention that everything else that Rockstar have talked about uh, going on in this event week, uh, the discounts, bonuses, sales, and more are also going to be ending on October 2nd. So I figured I would mention that as well. Everything is basically lasting for one week long. So you've got until now, until October 2nd, to take advantage of everything we've discussed in this video today. And the final thing that Rockstar has got going on is the premium races and the time trial. This week's time trial is Tungva Valley, which has a par time of 58.8 seconds. So it's a pretty quick one in order to accomplish. The premium race is downtown underground, which is actually locked to the supercars and takes place in Strawberry. So if you want to get some extra money, you can tackle both the regular time trial and the premium race. And the RC Bandito time trial this week is Vespucci Beach, which has a time trial of two minutes and five seconds. So if you're really good at the time trials and the premium races, again, just an extra way to make some money in Grand Theft Auto Online. 
But anyways, that is everything that is going on this week. Even though Rockstar didn't add a new vehicle, there's some pretty exciting stuff happening. So I'd love to hear from you guys in the comments down below. What do you think of this current event week, the survivals, the free money, uh, the bonuses, discount sales, and more? Let me hear your thoughts, opinions, and more in the comments down below. I'd love to hear from you guys down there. If you guys did go on to enjoy this video, though, a like rating would, of course, be awesome. And be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new or you want to stay up to date on all the latest GTA and Red Dead Redemption 2 videos that I'm doing here on my channel. And be sure to ring that notification bell as well. Sometimes YouTube just doesn't work, and if you ring that bell, you'll always be guaranteed to be notified when new videos arrive. But of course, as always, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.